Hey, welcome back to the garden. Or farm, depending on what you want to look at it. See, I got a lot of sunflower stalks to pick up. But today I want to talk about organic material. What is organic material and why is it so important? Well, organic material is literally anything that is left behind from an organic source. So that says, be seen down there. Let me get a little closer. This is all organic material. Free leaves, glass clippings, sticks, dead insects, bird poop. All that stuff is what we call organic material. Also, my battery's kind of low, and I've been having trouble with my editing software today, so who knows what this video will uptake. It may just be one of those days. But my target goal for any garden bed is 5%. For every 1% of organic material you have in your soil, it's going to give you a 10% return rate. That means that if I put a tomato in here, I can expect an average 30 pounds. I add 2% organic material, but now that 32, assuming that 30 pounds is getting times by 20. I draw in my compost, now I can have times it up to 0.5. I draw my worm bin, my worm castings, it's another 0.5. I draw my pollen errors in, that could be as much as high as 19 times. So it's very advantageous. This is the reason why so many people love being an organic gardener. Problem, as I've said, organically speaking, is much slower. So what are some ways that we can combat that? Well, that's why I run a worm bin. I can bring compost out every single month from that. Then I can save on my yard waste, turn that into a uh, mulch material. That brings that back into the fold and save in mulch. Now, if you don't have that system and you're needing some mulch, yeah, go buy mulch. I mean, it's not very expensive, but to me, there's no point in buying mulch if I have it available. It's just I did not want to lay my compost underneath my hive because I wanted my compost to go where I want it to. And so that's just going in my Blackberry. But today is a bit sur a sort of video because there's not a whole lot I can harp about organic material. It's this, that. Know this. You want 5% and that increases your mass, or assuming your rate of return by 50%. And that's on top of everything else. So, if you're wanting to start a garden for the springtime, get a compost pile starting now. I cannot harbor about that enough. It doesn't matter what compost you use, what you like using. Just go get, go start one. Use an old bin if you have to. And if you're wondering about the uh, pumpkin, it's really getting up there. But thanks for joining. Feel free to like, sub, or subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks.